Hi, it's Rosie from Rose Van Enko. I have uh, two journals to show you today. Um, they are in the yellow theme, and uh, one is a 4x6, and uh, the other one is a 4x5 in size. And uh, each one has um, similar uh, style, but uh, different items and uh, pages and pictures inside. Um, this is a uh, 4x6 inches in size, and it has a 2 inch spine. And um, it has a tassel here with a ribbon and a little bit of this uh, flower that uh, matches um, the flower on the cover. And it actually is um, named Sherlock after this flower that uh, came up on my tag. And I just like the tag so much that I thought, okay, I'll just go with this for the title. So this is a belly band. You could put something else in it really if you wanted to. And um, uh, I do have uh, two fabrics here, the yellow one, um, such as this one, that is the closure, and then some lace on top, and it uh, continues over um, to the back as well. So um, this one is a botanical journal, lots of flowers, um, but some other things in the yellow theme as well. Um, I did try to find as many things in yellow as I could, but you know, sometimes when you're looking for a particular color, it doesn't want to uh, come up readily, so I did have uh, quite a bit of looking up to do. Uh, with the um, supplies that I had on hand at the moment. Um, so I, I do have some buttons here as well and uh, some charms um, that I put in and then ribbon on the sides here and all the fluff on the top that I usually have and this uh, very pretty little bit sparkly flower in the front. Um, so like I said, there's uh, two journals. This is the bigger one. I will show you what's inside and then I will also show you the smaller one as well. So um, just to mention, um, this is uh, a soft cover um, bendable journal uh, so that, you know, it fits easier into your purse or your night table where you might have to squish it in a little bit. Um, so going inside, um, in the first signature, there are three signatures and um, they are chock full of uh, different things. So it starts off uh, with this beautiful vintage uh, postcard. Um, that I got at a sale somewhere and uh, while well, this gentleman is wearing the yellow suit that uh, seemed to fit right in. So you have a pocket right here, right away. And then uh, here's one of those uh, wreaths um, that I usually have in a journal. And uh, there's uh, poems and this beautiful cardstock uh, right here. Uh, on the next page, uh, we have some journaling cards. Um, these are mostly uh, from the graphics fairy that I use the uh, printables and then um, a lot of the uh, authentic ephemera as well. So a little bit of a uh, um, fabric here and then some ecodite um, paper um, that turns out this beautiful muted colors and then some um, flowers from a um, vintage book that I have with a tab on top and a pocket here with a little yellow snail um, fit right in here and in the back of course you can always write on it and I have this yellow <clears throat> line paper and just stamped it up a little bit and um, it looks like a wall here behind some statues um, that I found somewhere and this one has a little charm on it that says happy and then a little bit more of the yellow here another belly band here and then there's a collage of yellow flower and some matching uh, fabric on it as well. I do like to do a lot of collaging so everything that you see practically is a collage including on this belly band as well. And um, this is a pocket here uh, with uh, some fabric on top here as well and ribbon. And inside uh, we have another yellow flower here. And a little bit of extra space for writing here. And uh, we have a, a library card and on the back of it is a little fabric here on top and then some more so like a little notebook writing space here and over here from a um, vintage book and this one here opens up into this beautiful yellow themed uh, scene and then inside as well yellow i believe and a little bit of uh, writing um, spot over here and some more yellow Uh, this one is um, a little bit um, more like cardstock from uh, one of those uh, folders 
where it gives you tabs on top. Uh, this is a mushroom here um, that is um, my art. And then over here, um, everything has some kind of collage on it or fabric. Um, this one has a little poem. And a little bit more yellow here and um, some marble paper here. This one actually my daughter did and I asked her if I can use it because it has yellow in it. So she let me borrow that. And um, a little bit more of the no book here. So each page is pretty well adorned with something. A little bit of the writing space here. And this is uh, the pocket again. Here you have a butterfly, yellow butterfly. You can It's a sticker and you can stick it on any other page that you would like. And so we get a little bird with uh, some yellow. And then a flip out. Another belly band over here with a generally card. And a little bit more collaging here. More of this yellow paper stamped up a little bit. Uh, another collage of here. It's really um, like a cluster or what you want to call it. Um, but you can write on the back as well. So you can also paste it anywhere else if you want to glue it somewhere else. A little bit more paper. The eco dye paper. And a little bit of the index card. And a uh, window that we found on wiki art. A little bit of fabric over here. And this is the second signature, and this is a poem um, by Charlie. Actually, my husband uh, somehow started in his late years um, to come up with these um, uh, poems that, well, I didn't know was inside him, so I asked him to write me something about yellow, and he sure did. So anyways, this is a little poem um, in here about yellow. And a little journal card here, and a little more fabric here. You could add paper and Edith Holden um, pages where I could find yellow. And uh, another belly band over here. And a little bit of a journaling card and collage. And uh, this chair in yellow hedges. liked it a lot. So a little bit of beads here and more uh, ribbon over here. And a little envelope uh, that was eco dyed. And then inside I put a little bit of a... A notebook also with this um, yellow ladybug that I found in a book and I like using um, anything uh, any different kinds of paper to write on uh, whether it's lined paper or whatever kind of paper I just like different pages so um, this one is a beautiful yellow flower here and then on this side um, I found this in a children's book it was just so cute uh, with the little dollies around this uh, with the yellow hats and uh, a humongous yellow shoe. So I just clipped that in here. So over here we have a flip out and then a library card here. And over here a little uh, notebook with some fabric on top of the sunflower uh, with uh, yellow tabs on top. Um, and uh, different ones that I could find with uh, different fabric and uh, ribbons and so on. In the middle of the second signature, um, there's a journaling card and a tag over here uh, with some yellow pears on there and on this one. And a bit of uh, more of the poem, another notebook over here. So lots of um, space for um, to journal on as well here, in the, all in the yellow theme. And this one um, has a card, um, oh, I'm sorry, an envelope here. And uh, you can fill it up with something, but I did give you a little bit of um, a paper here with a yellow border. So, and on the back here. So on the back of this is this uh, beautiful flower in yellow and um, some stamping over here and a forsythia tag over here. And as well, I have these um, little charms on the bottom, on, this, uh, on the sides here with beads in yellow butterfly in yellow here and as well as a postage stamp on this one the chair uh, that, that I had on the other side it's partner here and here I have a little belly band here and um, a journaling card and um, the other side of Edith Holden and a little bit of more of that eco dye paper and over here is some yellow fabric 
and um, generally card and some more paper. So lots of different um, textures and so on throughout the book here. And um, over here I have words that I printed up, um, canary, buttercup, sunshine, uh, that would come in yellow as well with a little bit of cheesecloth on the sides. And uh, over here, index card and a uh, yellow rose. And um, over here, a more Edith Holden, uh, yellow flowers. And a little vase over here with uh, fabric tabs on the sides. And this one has uh, a beautiful, uh, very old Europe, uh, European uh, map. And that came in yellow. And over here, this flower and this beautiful leaf uh, together, very pretty. And then um, journal card in this pocket. And over here, a little bit more for the writing. And this is a collage here on each side. Uh, on this side, I have a collage. And this side, I have a little bit more writing space. And inside also, a journaling card. Also, all kinds of uh, collaging. Uh, a vintage, uh, from a vintage book, flowers. And then over here, a little uh, flower charm. And a little bit of a notebook with uh, fabric on top, our ribbon. And uh, more of that marble paper. And over here is a butterfly with a yellow flower and he continues here on the other side. And over here a little bit of a map and so on. The title, Charlock, in case you forgot. Journaling card. A more notebook. And uh, flip up over here on this yellow pocket with some more journaling card inside. And this beautiful collage on the other side. Um, more for Scythia tag over here. And this is a journaling card with a photo of a building in yellow that I took in Croatia. So that's my own photography on this one. And a little bit more beads here in yellow. And um, here you have a large piece of paper. It's just folded and with some ribbon on top. You can use that somewhere else if you would like or do something else with it. So it's a little bit bigger piece. And at the very back, at the end, um, we have a little notebook and it has pockets on each side with a journaling card. And inside it has a little Canadian maple leaf. And it's covered in organza or some sort of uh, fabric. So this one is a uh, Charlock and it's a four by six journal. And um, I hope um, you might I want to check it out at the Etsy shop as well. So this is the, the bigger one of the two. I'll show you the other one now. So this is Elamanda. It is a four by five inch in size with three signatures and a two inch spine. It has a similar tassel over here um, with a little bit of uh, the beads on the bottom as well. And this is Elamanda, uh, the flowering here. This one has um, the uh, same uh, yellow uh, fabric underneath and then a different lace on top here and a different color flower here and um, Let me just uh, show you inside this one has a muslin um, closure uh, with the uh, uh, lots of different um, fluff on top and um, So in the beginning um, this one has all different papers, so uh, but in a similar style so a little bit of uh, what the flower is and over here a little bit more about it as well. These are journaling cards with paper on the back to write on. And so it's a pocket. You can put different things in a pocket really in the front. And um, uh, right over here is uh, a little bit of a charm that says truth on it. And a um, little butterfly here and a tiny little um, tag with yellow on it. And on the top we also have the a little bit of a yellow and red um, wreath. And then Edith Holden uh, page with some yellow flowers. And um, the yellow lime paper, with a little bit more on the sewing on the side here. And this beautiful yellow flower on this side and a belly band with a tag with this beautiful butterfly on it and um, marble paper underneath. And of course, collage does everything is in collage lately. Um, this is just a little tiny pocket here for a butterfly here, and a bird in collage. And it's a pocket here uh, with a little um, notebook inside it. 
And in the middle, there's a butterfly as well. And get that back inside. Okay, a little bit of a flip up here. And a tag in yellow over here with this very yellow paper here. And um, here a little bit of stamping and that yellow edge paper with some uh, fabric tabs over here on the side. And uh, some book pages. And then this is a fabric on top of this notebook. And then the library card. And uh, we have here another, uh, this is a, a more of a, a little folder, but inside you have a little bit of a notebook and a fabric tab here and for writing space and a bird collage on the top. This one uh, is um, the middle, and as in the other one, in the middle uh, we have some yellow beads and a yellow button. And this one has, um, I was just gonna mention, so it's here, general journal, that was actually right on it and I left it. So this is one of those um, um, separating tabs that you normally get for paper and a little bit of a journaling card and a yellow index card, some of that marbling paper, stamping on the side, notebook here, and lots of the yellow uh, ruffles on the side. And this is another poem by my husband. It's very, very good, actually. I'm like, what is going on, honey? Um, but he's surprising me every day, a little bit of yellow beads here. And this one is a little notebook that you can take out with um, this beautiful yellow field on it and some fabric on top here or um, ribbon. Flip up here. Uh, this uh, pocket is empty. You can put something in it to try to leave you some space somewhere. And over here is uh, a plate, probably from um, Fairy Graphics. This beautiful yellow flower here, and I'll flip out a little bit more for me to hold them. And um, a tag here with marble paper. And so this is the first uh, signature, and it says oh, Amanda right on it too, just to remind you again. On to the second signature over here, also a little bit more about yellow here, and um, the tabs also. Uh, many uh, pages have these tabs, uh, either fabric or uh, lace or ribbon. And a little bit more of the um, yellow paper here to write on, and a little bit of a sunflower. You can hold them paper, the line paper with the flower on top here. And here's this yellow root. And a um, little notebook over here. This is um, uh, my own uh, photography here on this yellow flower and this yellow butterfly it was wrapping paper but very pretty. Um, this one has also from a children's book, the same one, um, Children in the Shoe. So anyways, this is the other side of it, also very beautiful and there's a beautiful yellow color um, with, it looks like uh, some kind of a toy, I guess, a passing time toy. And um, from a book text, and then a little collage over here. And this is a pocket as well uh, that I left for you to fill. And a map, more notebook, and everything's been coffee dyed or distressed in some way. This is a, also a pocket for you. And then um, this one is a flip out from uh, cardstock. And uh, this is just covering uh, the page here, just a fabric sample. But very pretty, a little bit stamping. And over here in the middle, uh, we have another card, journaling card and some more buttons. And a flip out. And um, yellow bird, canary. Also a fabric sample on top here. And over here a map and a Flip out, and over here, a bit of a journaling card. And this uh, a beautiful collage here. I usually include some kind of fabric, like some kind of tactile. It's always, you can feel it, there's texture and so on, um, on uh, almost every page. There's another butterfly with a pocket here, and a tiny pocket over here with just some uh, small papers for you. Otherwise, it opens up. 
And this is um, the end of the second signature with this beautiful flower and a little bit of extra note paper in yellow theme. And this one has um, that yellow butterfly here and the postage stamp in yellow on the back. So a little bit more about yellow and Alamanda over here. So on to the third signature here and this beautiful cardstock, each one is in this uh, tartan uh, uh, colors. Each one has a little bit of yellow on it. And here's more yellow beads in this one. Uh, a little bit more of the yellow paper. Uh, this one is a little bit just of a folder uh, with um, with a dandelion in it. That's my photography and more extra space. So always extra space for you to write in and different. This is just um, yellow shades uh, palette. Maybe that dandelion comes in or uh, yellow comes in. So just a little tiny folder of little different things in it. Eco dyed paper, Edith Holden beautiful paper. Uh, flip out here with a little bit of yellow on it as well. Um, this is from a vintage book on flowers. And uh, cheesecloth over here and a belly band that holds a larger um, journaling card. And um, vintage book page and over here another pocket for you to fill um, but here this beautiful uh, collage again and then a flip out for writing and a flip out here as well uh, this uh, this is from wiki art where um, you can find all kinds of art in different colors so whatever it is you need this one is about the sun and then you have um, the envelope here as well with more writing paper and just some uh, yellow um, vintage book page a notebook here with coffee dye paper or tea dye paper and then the organs on top library card and this one has a little bit of um, envelope um, you can put some postage stamps into or something it has this very pretty little French on the bottom and just clips over here so we're in the middle of the third signature um, here um, is uh, here are a couple of uh, journaling cards and each uh, or most of the cards have some kind of um, ribbon or um, thread or whatever I uh, could find in the yellow color and so on. Um, I usually like to put something on the journaling cards, just something other than the picture itself. In the middle is um, are these um, yellow buttons and, and tabs on top the marbling paper, stamping, another little notebook with uh, some more uh, fabric on top, and uh, tabs over here, and just a book uh, page over here, and these um, beautiful peaches over here, and yellow tab, and a yellow pocket here for you to fill in. There's the other side of the uh, flip out, um, cardstock. Uh, this one um, does have a, a little notebook in it um, with uh, my photography and in the middle just a little bit different size paper and um, on the other side of um, the pocket of course is uh, more collage um, this belly band I left for you to fill and here's a little um, charm button and over here a flip out with a little bit of collaging in here and a little bit stamping and this one is a little holder that has a uh, buttercup in it. It says buttercup right here and a uh, uh, vintage uh, piece of paper for writing. And at the very back, I have the words sunshine, bees, and bananas, just to remind you they're all yellow, of course. And at the very back here in the pocket here, and this is all fabric, uh, by the way, on the front and the back, and a journaling card with a little bit more of a, a yellow um, tulip here. So this is Alamanda. It is a four by five inch journal and um, it's in the Etsy shop now. Hopefully we'll go to its new owner very uh, soon. Thank you for looking at these. So these are the two um, journals I have in my shop right now. And um, again, thank you for coming by to look at these. I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Rosie from Rose Bye-bye.